And now, your KRCG 13 Storm Vision Forecast with Zach Evans. Well, some very strong and severe storms made their way through mid-Missouri earlier today. Now most of us are just working with cloudy skies and a little bit of spotty rain. As far as any watches or warnings, we just have a severe thunderstorm watch in effect for our central and eastern counties. That goes until 11 a.m., but we're going to be in the clear way before then. So basically, consider yourself threat-free as long as those storms have moved through where you live. And trust me, you'll know if they've made their way through your area. Now, we also have a flash flood warning to the northwest. Be very cautious if you see any standing water in that direction. Do not attempt to drive or walk through it. It does not take much to sweep you or your car away. Now, here's how those storms looked as they moved through, quickly developing a line to our northwest and sliding to the southeast. And they left uh, a decent amount of damage in their wake. Lots of reports of trees down in Columbia as well as wind gusts in excess of 70 miles per hour. Now, it's basically the folks along I-44 that are being affected by these storms. Again, they're not severe, but still very strong. The best you can do is just stay inside. A closer look at the storm track for the folks that are in the path of this, mainly in Phelps County, or rather Pulaski County in Phelps County, I should say. Steelville, we'll see these at 616. Austria at 623. Clinton at 624. So these are going to quickly push out of mid-Missouri, and we're just going to have some spotty rain left over after that. Temperatures in the 60s, 66 in Columbia. The capital city has 68. Once this storm cluster moves towards the east, just a little bit of rain until about 10 a.m. or so. Then once we hit the afternoon, we'll see a mix of sun and clouds. Can't rule out some storms popping up near I-44 thanks to a cold front that's going to stall. Otherwise, we'll just see a mix of clouds taking us into the overnight hours. But we have more storm chances coming our way on Thursday. Now for today, we're going to make it into the 80s at 89. So very warm with the storms moving out, partly cloudy tonight into the 60s at 65. Seven day forecast has storm chances lasting through Sunday. Temperatures right around 80 degrees each day. We're finally dry by Monday.